Turn the page now and talk about our clean city and its weather. We, we got a lot of rain. We got a washing today. We got a washing today. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> A good old bath today. We certainly got that and the rain is continuing to taper off now. So some of you are starting to dry out, especially on the west side of town. The mountains, the foothills, you're drying out. Yes, those roads are still damp from the all day rain event. It was a washout of a day, but you can see the cloud icons here. Notice the clouds are starting to break up by 10 o'clock tonight. Overnight, we will have a mostly clear sky into the start of your day tomorrow. But we are not there yet. The rain is continuing to push through central North Carolina, also pushing through the PD region of South Carolina, hugging the coast, the Outer Banks, getting drenched right now with ongoing rainfall. And those of you east of Charlotte moving through Union, Anson County, Richmond County, as well into Chesterfield, Lancaster. These showers are now pushing through also parts of Columbia dealing with the ongoing rainfall. So here's the change. Over the next 12 hours, these rain chances are coming down by 8 o'clock tonight. We're down to about 20% in terms of the potential rainfall. After midnight, our rain chances down to zero. Now we'll still have a little mist out there in some areas because of the fog. That fog is developing, so we'll watch for that coming up tomorrow morning. Also tomorrow morning, trade in your raincoats for those winter coats. You need those extra layers tomorrow morning. So if 36 is not cold enough for you, well, then how about 28? This is Friday morning, also 29 below freezing. The freezing mark is 32 will be below it for the next couple of mornings, especially into the start of your weekend. But then the numbers will moderate by Sunday and Monday. Now, afternoon highs, this is a different story. We'll come in around 52 for highs tomorrow. So this is part of that warming trend. So this graphic here over the next six to 10 days shows that we're leaning above average when it comes to our temperatures. So your afternoon highs will come in above where we should be this time of year, which is around 52, 53. And you'll see those numbers. I have them laid out for you on the guy roof and seven day forecast in just a second. But first, Let's jump into your weekend to be here before you know it. So Saturday we will have highs in the mid to upper 50s. That's right. What a comeback for Saturday. However, Sunday we're going to have highs around 52 and those showers will come in and also may keep some of us in the 40s. So Saturday looks to be the better of the two days to be outside. Here's the guy roof and seven day forecast looking ahead beyond mm -hmm. Sunday. Temperatures warming up into the low 60s along with daily rain chances for early next week. WCNC Charlotte will be back after the break.